your boy K Brasho 880 once again. I know it's been a while since my last uh, or anything since I posted anything. So I'm gonna tell you guys what I've been doing. Uh, this is how my bike looks now. Still the same bike, uh, 95 ZX7 Kawasaki Ninja. Um, still got to do a little more touching up as far as the paint goes, like here. Shit drip down. That's the uh, I tried to uh, black it out the lens, but it just dripped and I ended up scraping some of it off. But in a nutshell, let's move back. That's how it looks now. I went back to the red, black and white. I did change the color to uh, kind of a peanut butter, orange, and a turquoise. You know, I was really digging the earth tones, which the paint is still under there. What I did was, before I did any of coloring, I used a Plasti Dip as my base coat. Uh, so that way, when I'm ready to peel this stuff up, pretty much I can go back to my uh, my autumn fall look. You know? So, uh, there's uh, put Gucci on the side, on the windscreen. Okay, I cut the skull out, so this is actually see-through. Okay. I finally got a front fender. It took me forever to find the side fairings, but uh, I did find them. Now, the fucked up thing is, uh, I found the fairings uh, on uh, Craigslist. This guy needed a paint job, so I painted his bike, hooked it up. He gave me the fairings. He wanted to rock a Street Fighter. That was on a Friday. By that same Monday... I was riding and I didn't put the front on and I barely had the sides attached and I lost lost the left side so I had to go get another one okay but you guys check out I don't know if you can see that there we go I got Gucci in the vents side of the tank also on my brackets I also installed the new chrome spike billet uh, footrest Yoshimoro exhaust. I actually took that off of a ZX6 that I have uh, in the back. Uh, new chrome mirrors. These babies are sick. Also, the chrome blade levers and my same chrome uh, hand grips. Uh, the spikes, these spikes just came in today. So I put a few on some places. I'm waiting on my red red spikes to come in, so I can lace those babies on. Skull on the seat, Gucci skull on the rear seat. I smoked out the tail light, and I also have the skull turn signals, which I did not connect. Uh, just one, really want them there for design. Cause I got a lot of signals in the back. I got the integrated tail light, and I still have my LED tail light uh turn signals okay now for the electronics what i did do was shit left my key in the damn house hold on As far as the electronics go, I got tired of looking at the old gauge, so I went on and installed these babies. Ain't she beautiful? Also installed the gear indicator, so I can now know which gear I'm in. And you can see straight through my skull. Let me start it off for you. Took me a while to hook this thing up. It is from China and they're definitely not the best when it comes to uh, color coding. Alright, but I was able to get it hooked up properly. Got my signal indicators now. My other indicators didn't work. This is how the signals look. I 
also the uh, spike spool setter. I mean, now, now I am going to end up making a video on which wire goes to what to connect this gauge up because if you don't have the original COSO, it is a pain in the ass. Uh, to look at the chart and try to figure this thing out it's it's, it's really a pain in the ass so I'm going to make a video uh, you know just going over what I connected to what pretty much and you know that'll be that so that's my update I just put the, D, the ZX7 decals on last night okay and I also have the Kawasaki D, decal underneath I should have put it right here that that would have looked a lot better but eh whatever well that's my update that's my baby I didn't put the stereo back on yet I do have a I got a shark uh, motorcycle system uh, stereo system um, I'm thinking about putting that on there but I'm just not sure yet I want to see what I want to do with all of this space I have now that's a lot of space in there Alright, so that's my update. Uh, subscribe, comment, like. Let me know what you guys think or if you have any ideas that I can run with. And we'll take it from there. Oh, also, these, uh, head, these uh, what is it called? Windshield screws. These parts right here. Got those on eBay for dirt cheap. And they look nice on there. But I oh also I'm oh I am waiting for my wrap the rest of my wrap to come in. This is uh, I know the paint job looks pretty rough. It looks from a distance it looks good, but when you get up close it's like ah what happened. But anyway, I'm waiting for the wrap to come in. It's going to be it's going to be a gray carbon fiber wrap here and on the front and side fairings, and I have the white carbon fiber for the tail. Alright, everything else is going to pretty much stay the same. And it'll also clean up my lining on my Gucci material a bit. Alright, so, you know, that's it. If you're in New York, let me know if you need material. I have a tan, a tan color Gucci. I have a purple. And I also have a all black, a black on black Louis Vuitton. Alright, holla at your boy. K. Bradshaw signing out.